Welcome to Mother Daughter Projects. I'm Steph. I'm Vicki. Good morning. <laughs> it's the day of the hurricane. Hurricane day. Um, so we made a previous video about our prep for Hurricane Idalia and we thought we would do an update video. So far it is 7.30 mm -hmm. on August 30th and we made it through the night. Mm -hmm. uh, we slept fairly well. Mom actually spent the night in my house um, because it was supposed to hit in the middle of the night and so we weren't sure, you know, what would happen mm -hmm. and so for safety we did that. Um, but what news do we wake up to? <laughs> we woke up to the news, the best case scenario that sometime around midnight, it took a little veer to the east and it's gonna make landfall near a town called Perry. It's actually, they say it's a very, where it's gonna hit, it's gonna be in a very uh, low populated area. So it was really the best case scenario, maybe not for those people, but for Tallahassee. Um, the biggest problem in Tallahassee is that we have so much tree coverage that that's where most of the damage comes from is yeah. the um trees falling it's and that was my biggest concern because actually around steph's house is and my house too lots and lots of trees so we're still not out of the woods no. um we definitely hear a steady stream of rain outside tosh my dog will not go out she obviously won't. and Probably i don't girl. really want her to go put down a couple of puppy pads and um she hopefully will just pee on a puppy pad <laughs> she never has in her life but you know we'll uh, we'll figure that out well, you'll just clean it up and yeah but wh she's wherever she's fine. super chill she's just like sleeping right now so that's awesome we do know that the power will go out it's been flickering and so we're trying i'm downloading big bang theory right now and we have a candle on for the power goes out we have lights ready so fans so. uh, we have a lego set to build and a puzzle. puzzle so you know that's we know that's gonna happen mm -hmm. um we're already kind of like planning some stuff. So we'll keep you updated as to how the day progresses and hopefully we'll be able to get out after the storm and kind of see what around, what everything looks like. Okay, we'll see you in a bit. That's the update. Uh, now it's official, we have the verified landfall. That is where the core is, and that's where Keaton Beach is. So that's it, precisely where we're seeing it. Definitely more than half of the center of the circulation will be onshore. Keaton and Deagle Beach are kind of neighbors uh, next to each other. So there's the marker there. Let's go. Okay, it is 1 p.m. here in Tallahassee, Florida. And mom, what do you think? I think it's over. Yes, so we definitely <laughs> braved the storm. We really lucked out with the turn. We did really luck out. Turn in the shift. Um, but yeah, it's basically um, really just some winds, rain, but um, really not much, no damage, just a little branches, Definitely like not leaves. Even, not even yeah. much. So it's, you know, it is, uh, best case scenario yes. for this area that it just took a little tiny turn to the to the um, east and really we just got winds and yeah. uh, a little bit of rain nice rain because we needed the rain we're really happy we did all the prep that we did also at the end of yesterday us took pictures of everything mm -hmm. inside and outside of my house so if there was damage i had kind of proof of what everything looked like but still really happy we did all of the prep and we're gonna you know, put everything back uh, in the near future. Not the gazebos until after hurricane season, we've decided because that was a lot of work. It, well, was it wasn't as lot, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be actually. So um, well, it will be interesting to see once we, oh, listen, to, listen. Still a little wind. Still a little windy, yes. yes. So this is basically the journey of a hurricane here in Florida. This is the best case scenario, but yes. you really never know until it really is close and you basically have to already have your prep done. Mm -hmm. So we're and glad. A lot, of, a lot of people get mad that they've done all this prep and nothing happens. Well, I'm know, not I'm mad. Like, I'm not mad. I'm, I'm happy. Mad. I'm happy about it. Yeah. Well, you know, and the change didn't happen occur until midnight last night. So yeah. that would have been... I mean, th there's no time. There's, you know, it changes so quickly. So um, it's better to err on the side of too much prep than too little. Yeah. And the big bonus of everything is our power never went off. That was so shocking <laughs> because we were for sure it was going to go off. It did go up at mom's house. So it was good that she actually stayed at my house. So I still had, you know, electricity, yeah. air conditioning. <laughs> we had um, internet. Oh, there it is yeah. again. Let's go. 
still kind of creeps me out just a little bit when that happens. It's still, you know, still some storm weathers, but um, we're definitely like, it's it's pretty much past us. You still get some of those winds. Yeah. But um, yeah, so that is a hurricane. That's our hurricane Here update. Florida, our so, hurricane update. Yeah, so um, we're still smiling, so yeah. it's all good. And uh, we are going to be having a little bathroom remodel project at mom's house coming up in the next few weeks. Yes. Yeah, should be posted next I'm actually weeks. very excited about yes. it. It's, it's so cute. Yeah, it's so it cute. turned out really well. It, it did, it really did. All right, well, thanks for joining and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Good girl. Good girl.